And welcome back to Let's Talk Business on CentralValleyTalk.com. I'm Mike Scott. Thank you for tuning in today. We are joined right now by Emilio Hernandez, who works for London Properties out of their Sanger office. I didn't realize. How many different offices did you tell me London has? We have one in Kingsburg, um, Clovis, Fresno, uh, Matera, uh, Merced, and Oakers. Oakers. Yes. Boy, so they're expanding. Yes, yeah. we're everywhere. So you're in the Sanger office, so yes. does that mean you specialize in Sanger or you can uh, sell anywhere in the anywhere, Valley? Anywhere in Central Valley. Yeah, but you, you, I bet you know Sanger. Yes. Yeah, yes. yeah. That you're, did you grow up in that area? Or? Actually, I actually grew up in Parlier, but I moved in Sanger three years Parlier, ago. Parlier, Sanger, it's yeah, all it's the, same the same area. Same area, yeah. yes. How's, how's uh, sales good right now in the uh, Sanger real area? Good, real good, yeah. Low inventory, um, <laughs> seller's market. Um, you need more people to put their houses on the yes, market right that's now. that's what we do. We need yeah. to do that, yes. So it's a, it's a seller's market. It is. Meaning that they're getting multiple offers on uh, houses? At least, I would say from five to eight offers each house. On every there, house? On every house out there, yes. Wow. Yes. Are there uh, bidding wars breaking out? That's what it is. The people uh, bid over, asking price, wow. and they go with that. So you're sitting there going, cha-ching! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You like when there's bidding more, yes. right? Yes. yes, But, I mean, that's a sign of a healthy economy, right? Yes, it's pretty much, uh, like I said, seller's market, so it's stabilized in the market right now. Yeah. yeah. Is it is it lower-end homes that are selling, or medium, or expensive homes, or, or all of them? All of them. Really? Yes. Uh -huh. Can I get into the real estate business oh, right you now? Do, of course. <laughs> it's a good time to get in. I mean, well, you had a lot of rough years, though, right, yes. that you had to... Uh, yeah, I've been on the market for about close to six years. So six I, years? I started when the market was going down a little bit. So I went through it. So I took it as a learning process for me. So I know it's good. So what did you learn from those tough times? Well, uh, just stay focused on kind of market myself. I mean, I had a part-time job before. So then I decided to just go full-time on it. Yeah. Uh, it takes a lot of time. Yeah. I mean, you have to have, uh, have to be a full-time agent in order to survive through that process. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, do you target, or, or you, do you specialize in Hispanic mostly, homeowners? Mostly and, Hispanic, and mostly Hispanic, a lot of Spanish people out there, so I work with them a lot. So you're yes. bilingual? Bilingual, yes. Which helps? Yes, yes, a lot, it helps a lot. In the Sanger area? Mm -hmm. Well, I guess anywhere in the Central Valley, really. Pretty much, yeah, everywhere. I mean, there's a lot of Hispanic people everywhere. I mean, well, I'm out there with them. Yes. So how do you find your clients? Uh, or do they find you? Uh, well, we have a, like London, uh, we have a website there, that um, LondonProperties.com. If you're looking for an agent, uh, someone that you know, I mean, just go in there and click their name and you'll find them. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. what, what are the hot areas of the valley right now? What's, what's really selling? Well, uh, pretty much everywhere. <laughs> Everything's selling, yes, huh? Yes. Uh, there aren't little pockets that are hotter than others? Uh, th there's a few, but I mean, uh, it just depends. People right now, that um, they're buying on the 150s to 200s, and there's higher price. So, I mean, there's a lot of people that are, are within that bracket. Hmm. So that's what they're buying right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I haven't checked um, interest rates lately. Where are they hanging right now? Right now, it's like, a, I would say like about 4.3, That's on a 30-year? Yeah, three, okay. days, three, three year fix, yes. And even less for a 15, right? Uh, it will be less, yes. If it's 15 years, it will be less. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you try to steer people into it? Well, that's not, that's the, the lender's end. The lender's end, side. But, the lender's side. It just yeah. depends on where they want to be at, how soon they want to pay their, their, their house. Uh, I mean, but Your monthly payment's going to be a little higher with a 15 year. It will be. But you own the place in 15 uh, years. In 15 years. That's well, it's correct. yours. But a lot of people going for 30 years, which is that uh, minimum right now. I mean, 30 years everywhere, yeah. uh, unless you got a big down payment, then you go 15 and your payment will be lower too. Mm. Yeah. Are there any government programs out there right now that you can tell people about that there might is, help them there for is, the uh, first time? Uh, it's called a CHADAP program. CHADAP? CHADAP, that's what it's called. And they usually help with either the down payment or their um, closing costs, which is about, the buyer will end up paying about 1.5% out of the pocket. So, and plus when we make offers, uh, we ask for closing costs, and which most uh, banks are paying for that. Banks are paying for closing yes, costs right now? half of it mostly, yes. Wow. We don't ask for the whole uh, uh, percentage, just half of the percentage. You ask for the whole thing. <laughs> well, if they, if they would pay for it, I mean, we would, but sure. they're, they're, not, they're not paying, just yeah. half of it mostly, yes. Wow. Is it because one bank is doing it, all the rest have to, or? Not really. Uh, well, I mean, if they want to sell the properties, they, they should help out, I mean, to, to get it. Sold. Sure. Yes. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. So how did you get into the business? Well, um, 
I've been wanting to do this for the longest time. And I've been Did you do something before I was real a, estate? Yes, I was a school bus driver before. Really? Yeah, I was kind of like a part-time. Driving in that crazy valley yes. fog? Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> um, I, did that I for, know. <laughs> I did that for the longest time. So meanwhile, I got my real estate license in between. So I've been doing this for six years. So I decided just to leave the driving and get into real estate full-time. What, what were the age of the kids you were driving around? Uh, from between, uh, all the way to um, eighth grade. Mostly special ed kids. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. I was dealing with them, special ed kids. I was going to say, how do you deal with a bus load of kids that aren't behaving? But well, uh, special ed, uh, I mean, they're... The special ed kids are probably pretty good. Yes. Yeah. Uh, some of them and some of them not. I mean, but I dealt with them for You dealt years. with them? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. But so you left that behind and went into real estate. Real estate. So you, you studied for your license, right? And yes. Did you pass the first time? No, actually, no. I, it's a tough test. It, it yeah. is. It is. I actually passed until the third time. Wow. Which is, I mean... But it, it is, that's a bear of a test, yes. I know. If you want it, I mean, you'll... You'll, you'll keep you'll doing it until it. you get it. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it was worth it, wasn't it? It was, yes. Because really you finally it. say, I did it. I did it. <laughs> yeah. And did you go to work right away for London Properties? Or? No, I was working with a different broker. But I've been with London for about three years, which is a very good company. I mean, a lot of... They're them. a well-known yes. company in this area. Uh -huh. So I've been there with them, three years with them. Three years. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Um, I would like you, in Spanish to tell everybody out there whatever you'd like to about yourself? Well, uh, in Spanish, right? Yes, please. Well, mi nombre es Emilio. Uh, estoy allá en, en Fresno County para ayudar a la gente que habla español. Uh, cualquier pregunta que tengan, este, pues háblenme. Estoy aquí para ayudarles. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, people can go to the London Properties website to find you? Yes. Okay. They just could click my name in there and they'll find me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you have email or Facebook? Or? Uh, Email, uh, ehernandez at londonproperties.com. ehernandez uh, at londonproperties.com. At londonproperties yeah. Or my cell phone, which is 360-4440. 360-4440. 4440. Yes. Easy number to remember. Yes. Uh -huh. Emilio, thank you for coming in today. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. All right. Thank you. Emilio Hernandez from London Properties, the Sanger office. But he can sell your home anywhere. Right? Mm, right. And you're watching centralvalleytalk.com.